before I start this video, I want to ask you to support me by subscribing to my channel. And please like this video if you find it helpful. And of course, if you have some questions or suggestions, welcome to the comments. And we jump right in. Now we can include our final JS and CSS files using the asset function in the tweak template. It will look like this. You should not render script and link tags by hand when you use Encore with Symfony. We will use some helper function from Webpack Encore bundle. In fact, in your base template, these functions already exist after installing the Twig bundle. For the style sheets, use this function Encore entry link tags and up passed here because it's the name of the entry. For the scripts uses this function and core entry script tags. Next I want to work with CSS files and replace all style sheet connections via assets with a webpack connection. Helper functions are already in the base template. So, it remains to import the needed files into ArcGIS and then remove the assets from the tweak templates. Let's do it. By the way, this dot means to look for a local file. As you can see, nothing broke on the pages. Everything looks correct. But there is one problem. We don't need to include uh, form CSS for all pages. We only need it for the login and registration pages. Let's figure out how to apply this style only to certain pages. First, let's create form.js file. Here we import form CSS file. Now in webpack config.js file, uh, we'll add the next setting. Yeah. 
Because Webpack config.js was changed, we need to stop and restart Encore. And finally, we need to include the link tag on the individual pages where we need them. forget to do one more thing. Uh, we need to delete import here. And let's open login page and check works it or not. Okay, the page looks correct. Now let's open registration page. As you can see, no styles applied to this form. Behavior is expected since no styles are included on this page. Let's fix it. I hope you enjoy this video and see you next time.